This is a preview of the new second generation TargetWorks Master Control. This is an overview screen that's showing Bay 1, Bay 2, Bay 3, Bay 4, Bay 5, as many bays that you have in your range. And uh, what we're looking at here is the lane timers, um, just to give you a, a visual of which lanes have expired uh, and which lanes have time left. Now this is a sort of a sped up version of what it's going to look like uh, here. So from the overview screen, you can swipe right and get to bay one. Here's where you'll be able to uh, select targets to set time limits. Um, we will be able to link up to most um, point of sale systems, assuming your point of sale systems will work with us uh, on this. But, um, and then also has the master to be able to take control um, for training purposes. We take control. Uh, this is somewhat running in a simulation mode now. So assuming we selected all the lanes. We're gonna have the same presets there, uh, the same ability to change the distance. Now this keypad will look like the ones on the, um, the booth control. This just isn't quite finished yet. Um, we do have the letter O uh, on the go button here. Also have the face edge and friends here as well um, for running the, the range controller. Back here we have, of course, a fire screen that we'll be able to utilize as well as uh, building courses of fire, lighting. Uh, there's a few more buttons that we're going to be adding here and moving a few of these around. The end of day button um, for the second generation system will hit end of day wherever the target carriers are. They'll all come home and then they will turn on the cleaning system and they will slowly go down range, all the way down range, clean the rail uh, of both lead dust and should you have a rubber bullet trap and pieces of rubber up on the rails, it um, will clean those off as well. Then the carriers will come back home and um, start automatically charging. And at that point in time, one of the requests that we had was the ability just to sort of quickly look up and down the range and make sure that all the carriers were in fact charging. So um, the target light, we're going to have a, a large amber target light that will flash slowly on and off to let the range officer know that, um, in fact, uh, we are charging. And that won't go on all night. We'll let that go for 15 or 20 minutes and then turn that amber light off. Um, then in the morning when you come in, you'll be able to take a look at the master control and, and um, do a, run a quick diagnostic on the carriers to see that they're all charged and ready to go. And again, the same control can also go to bay two, bay three, bay four, etc. Um, now, why if you have four bays, you'll have four master controls. But should one get damaged or broken, um, you can pick up any of the other ones and control the other bays. Somewhat of a another redundancy. So this is the preview of the second generation TargetWorks Master Control System. Thank you for watching.